How's it going? How's it going, my friends? Um, I had some lunch. I'm feeling revitalized. This is good. Okay, so let's see, is this video working? So sorry, just bear with me as I try and get this thing started. But, um, this video should be very exciting. I'm very excited to share this information with you. Because we've got here today how to best grind how to best farm for things like coin like heart like soul it's very important trying to get the different currencies k11 because there is really just way too much to spend the currencies on at this point you've got lucky towers you've got meteor towers you've got stage six towers but we've got this thing uh, this thing which should help with grinding all of these currencies for these activities just a lot easier okay so boy oh boy hopefully the notifications went out for this thing but do consider turning on that notification notification bells so that you don't miss out on the very intriguing things that we have to discuss here. Okay, so Rambo is currently accelerating to be like one of the best characters in MK11 just based around his augments. His augments alone just really allow for so much power in all sorts of things. So earlier today, we talked about Rambo Rambo being used to get through lucky towers, but now we've got Rambo being used to get us currency. And the thing that we should really start off with is this hidden M60. This is a build that is centered around the hidden M60, as well as these other augments here. Ammo dump, luckality, and defenseless. So all of these things are very much needed for this build. Build. Getting the Luckality Augment, it should not be too hard. I do recommend you check out my other video, Fastest Way to Farm Lucky Towers. But this is a build that is centered around the Luckality Augment for Rambo. You don't need it at level 4, but having it at level 1, level 2, it'll help a lot with getting currency. Ah, okay, so, uh, let's check out the comments. Hey there, Rambo Main. it has begun. Thank you so much, my friend, for joining along. Um, yes, we have all sorts of fancy things in the Jaded Bunny family, including emojis, as well as a precious sing-song at the end of this. So yes, lots of songs. Um, but Luckality, Ammo Dump, and Defenseless, these things really help out with getting currency, because essentially only these three augments are needed to get yourself flawless brutalities. Really. So the idea here is to use these three augments defenseless, luckality, and ammo dump to get us easy brutalities and easy flawlesses. Now, how is this accomplished? Well, in the classic towers, in survivor towers, you can set this thing to very easy, and let's say that you are going to be grinding. You can actually do this for yourself and get yourself a lot of currency this way. All you really need are just those three augments. Ammo dump, luckality, and defenseless, and you will be able to get yourself a lot of currency. So how is this possible? So first you need the ammo dump and the luckality augments in order to really cause instant brutalities. With the instant brutalities, oh, it's not, it's not beautifully purple, oh boy, I forgot that. With the instant brutalities, you can get yourself a lot of easy matches, quick wins, and at the same time, lots of currency. So let's check out how much currency we got here. We got 160 heart, 4,000 coin, 48 hearts. Okay, so this isn't really the best setup of the generic augments to give us, um, currency, so we're going going to have to tailor that around, but really just to demonstrate, there's a lot of power just from those three augments. Just those three augments. And the reason why all of this works so well is because there's great synergy between defenseless 
locality and ammo dump. So ammo dump means that your M60 is shooting 120 bullets. Now if you pair this with the locality and the defenseless, that means that you know, you have a 1 in 5 chance with every bullet for it to be unblockable. Once that first built bullet hits an opponent, the rest of the bullet stream will continue, and each of those bullets have an 8% chance to do an instant brutality so just using this combination of three augments means that you're getting yourself flawlesses and brutalities. This pairs very nicely with with the currency augments. So let's switch on over to this one. Now we have this set up for really three different modes. Three different modes. So the first mode that you see here, this is really focused on getting you hearts. Hearts is really important for getting a lot of things, such as doing stage six towers. Um, you will run out of hearts doing the last platform of lucky towers. Hearts is very important. So we're going to be talking about hearts first. So the augments that you want first are perfect combat, brutal heart, and good souls. Now you can also throw in there some other augments too if you want. I had their fast buck which gives you 4,000 extra coin for um, getting the first hit which is kind of inevitable if you're going flawless. The idea of the build is to go flawless. Now I showed off in the beginning that you can do this for yourself, but imagine if you could do this with just the AI. This is where the true power of Rambo comes in, like you don't have to play the game in order to get the currency. So here we've got this thing that is giving you hearts. This is first set up for hearts. So what you need is an AI behavior in order to really maximize on your time spent grinding for for whatever currency so what i suggest is taking off all of the reversal putting a lot into combos putting a lot into zoning and then just a touch of rush down this is what i found to be very successful for me i tested it out with the uh, various different attribute points and, and distributions but uh, what we're trying to go here if this makes sense you want 29 in zoning because you want to be able to have the ai perform the projectile move so 29 in zoning means that the ai is going to use the m60 which you want, right? You don't want the AI to use any other moves because you want that instant brutality with a flawless to give you lots of currency. Now, you've also got here 29 in combos. I experimented with having no combos, putting it in reversal. This is not a good idea. Reversal is not really a good idea. So reversal inherently means that your AI will want to block. This is not what you want the AI to do. You just want the AI to use the M60. So I would say don't put it into reversal. I would also say don't put it into runaway because runaway means that Rambo will want to use his slides a little bit more often than his M60. Not good. You don't want him to use other sorts of moves. But reversal means that he's blocking. Runaway means that he's going for slides. If you put too much into grappling, then he's going for throws. This is not what you want. So really, putting the 29 into combos is kind of what you're left with, but you need to do it, because if you have 29 in reversal, he's not amplifying the M60. And the instant brutality only works with an amplified M60. So you have 29 in combos, 29 in zoning, and this pretty much sets the AI up to go for the M60 move most of the time. Now, I say take out just a little bit from combos and a little bit from zoning, depending on your flavor on your liking, and put some into rushdown. Now, this might seem counterintuitive, right? But the thing is about zoning is that it has a natural amount of runaway built into it. If you leave the AI by itself, he will want to back up 
sometimes. So to counteract that wanting to run away, we put just a little touch into Rush Down. And this gives a little bit more consistency to the AI actually using the amplified M60 move most of the time most of the time. Um, even if he does not use the M60 right off the bat, it's very likely for him to get a Flawless and a Brutality, what with the Augments equipped. So we've gone over the ability, it's all about the M60, it's all about these AI attribute points, really a little touch of rush down, but a heavy investment in combos and zoning, and then you've got these Augments. Now this is really set up for hearts, we will be talking about the different currencies as well, but um, I think starting off with hearts gives you a better understanding of how these augments work. How these augments work. So let's get into the classic towers. Oh, let's also make this beautiful and purple. Let's also check out the comments. Thank you so much, guys, for joining along. Love you guys. It means so much. It means so much that you, you have come to join for Rambo action. Okay, um, I'm doing amazing, but Rambo is my main. OMG, I love, I love that um, Rambo main. You really love Rambo. Really true to your name. I'm doing well, my friend. Thanks for asking. This is good, Dreaded Jones. I'm glad that you are doing well. I'm doing a build with Shang Tsung. Cool. Hello, glad I caught this stream. I wanted to thank you as I got stupid lucky. I pulled a level uh, 3 luckality and a level 4 ammo dump during your lucky tower start. Yes, um, currency is capped at 250,000 um, per set, Samsa. Um, and we are going to be talking about how to get coin and souls best. Best in this game. Um, I see that there is also a tower coming soon. We will get the tower too. So what I'm going to show you here first is for hearts. This is with the augments that we've already talked about. Um, perfect combat, brutal heart. And because of the power of luckality, of the l ammo dump, of the defense list, you can really use the generic slots to give you a lot of different currencies at the same time. So we've got Good Soul giving us 164 of Flawless, and Fast Buck giving us um, 100, no, 4,000 coin for each Flawless. I mean, it's all just very inevitable when using this Rambo build. So we're going to put him on very easy. Hopefully Jackie does not come for my Rambo. Um, the build, when I was testing it, it was giving me very high percentages of flawless and brutality rates. So I would say this this build is somewhere between 96 and 98 percent at getting those flawlesses and those brutalities. So well, let's just see what, what he does here. So really, you want him to right off the bat and he does it which is just perfect right you don't want the ai to go for other moves you want him to just really go for the m60 um but as you see here we get some currencies five hearts 48 hearts now that's that's really what we're looking for the 48 hearts let's also back out of this ah oh we gotta get the meteor tower it's gonna go away i don't want it to go away so just bear with me as we get this thing hopefully the towers of time loads come on ps5 let's go let's go oh no oh no oh no nervous nervous oh we've got 30 seconds okay time to spare all right so yes um i was showing you there that that is really set up for hearts 48 hearts is all you can get from the augment bonus 48 is, is is the max and when you use a certain consumable tarkatan's cannibals blade that can pump you up to 106 off of just one match one match, 106 hearts. That's very nice, very nice. Um, but Rambo is doing this all with the AI. Like, this is not requiring me to do anything. He's just doing that for me. You know, these meteor towers are terrible. Just nothing, nothing. Ah, okay, so let's go back to the classic towers. So we forgot to use the actual consumable. Let's Rambo. go back. So the idea with this build, you put it down. And then you, like, as you're watching, like, a movie, or you're going to sleep, you press X. All you have to do is just press X. 
and then you get lots of currency, which is very powerful. And, uh, you know, in comparison to myself, like, I make a lot of human error in things. Like, I make mistakes, but the AI is just a lot more powerful than me in that respect. There is no human error with an AI. He just does whatever, right? So let's hopefully... Oh, oh, okay, all right. Sometimes, see, like, he likes to back up. So that's why you need just a little bit in rush down. Otherwise, he'll just back up the whole way. And the problem with Rambo AI in general is if you're at full distance, he won't want to amplify the M60. So you kind of want to be close. You don't want to be too far. So having just that little touch of rush down, I feel, just makes it um, better. Makes it more likely for Rambo to stand in spot and throw projectiles. So this is just... This is just really quick. <laughs> if you're not if you're not realizing this, all I'm doing is just pressing X and I'm getting myself lots of flawlesses, lots of brutalities, and lots of hearts. So let's check this out really slowly. Five plus forty-eight plus fifty-three, that's a hundred and six. Yay! So we're getting a hundred and six heart, just a lot easier in comparison to using frost, cold deficiency, this is quicker. This is way quicker. Like, I, I, but as you see, the level 8, the level 4 locality, it still requires some bullets sometimes. Um, if you don't have it at level 4, it is possible for you to go through a whole entire clip of 120 bullets and not brutalize the dude. So really getting the level 4 locality, it's good, but it's not necessary, really, considering the power of the AI build to just go get you flawlessly and brutalities while you just don't even do anything. This is this is really the best way of getting currency now in the game. And I suggest that you hop on it before they like nerf Rambo. I feel like a nerf for Rambo is going to come. It's inevitable. But Rambo is getting us all of these flawlesses, all of these brutalities. And I'm pressing no buttons, right? Like all I'm doing is pressing X. That's very easy. All I have to do is just press one button. The same button. So the advantages are that you can do this yourself. You can press the same button yourself. Or if you have like a turbo controller, you can really just have the controller pressing X for itself. And then you'll get lots of currency. Uh, this is way easier, way better than like using cold efficiency frost. Just because of the time to kill. The time to kill is really the highlight here. It takes just one move and instantly the characters, the enemy characters, are gone. They are just gone. So, um, I hope that you're seeing here that I'm getting lots of hearts. Let's check out how much hearts we've got now. But basically, if you do just a couple matches, you're gonna have enough hearts for a meteor tower. If you do a whole survivor tower, you're gonna have enough hearts for five meteor towers, right? So it's just really, it sets you up for getting the things that you really want in the game, whether that be meteor skins or stage six jinseis. But um, yeah, and the power of Rambo is that we're not only getting hearts here, each match we're getting 160 soul plus 4,000 coin. I mean, it's just easy. It's just easy currency. So this is setting up the, the build for getting hearts. This is how you would want to get hearts. Once again, let's go back to the build and talk about what's happening here. We've got um, Jade's last kiss. So in Rambo 2, like, you know when, like, the lady, like, she, like, died? That was Jade, right? Yeah, that was Jade. She kissed Rambo and then she died. Um, anyways. Um, so Rambo is getting a lot of power out of these three augments here. And this is a very powerful combo. Uh, I, I talk about it in my latest video, Fastest Way to Farm Lucky Towers. But we are going to be looking at this trio of augments more and more because there really are some great applications for Rambo using these three augments. Using these three augments in tandem means that you are basically guaranteed instant brutalities and if you pair these three augments with the right ai behavior you're pretty much guaranteed flawlesses so with 29 combos 29 zoning you're getting the ai to use the amplified m60 move as well 
he's using it right off at the beginning of the match. However, I don't suggest using a full 30-30 in anything. I don't think a full 30-30 is ever going to make a difference. Because when you take out that little bit and you put it in something else, you can really see some differences in the build. So with putting a little bit in Rushdown, it counteracts the AI's wanting or willingness to just run away with a high investment in zoning. It's just natural. You want to invest highly in zoning, the dude will want to back away. So to, to counteract that, you have to put in some Rushdown in order to keep the AI optimally placed so that he uses the amplified M60. And like I was saying, if you don't have the right settings, you'll notice that Rambo eventually ends up at full stage, and he's not amplifying the M60 at that point. So it really, rush down, good. But you don't want to take your rush down above like 3 or 4. Above that, he's going to start going for combo strings. So there is like trade-offs. But just a little bit, I, I think, is really good. The only ability that we're running here is this thing, Hidden M60, which is very nice. But these augments, like I said, we're running this for hearts. And I think understanding how to grind hearts first is advantageous. Because all we need to do is just swap some augments around uh, for souls. So let's swap this out. Okay, let's take this off. Let's put on heart and soul. Just one augment change. We just need to get this one here. There we go. Now we're set up to make souls. This is what we are doing. So um, now these augments will allow us to grind for souls. All that's happened here is now we are converting the number of hearts that we earn into 20 souls each, which is a, a great amount of souls. With this build, you will be making 1235 souls per match. So you want to keep good souls, which gives you 160 per flawless round, as well as perfect combat and brutal heart to give you the max amount of hearts. Convert that with heart and soul and you're going to get lots of soul. So let's take Rambo into the same activity. Very easy survivor towers. And mind you, this is all optimized for very easy. I would not recommend using this for regular towers of time. That will be a different video. Um, but this is really just for currency. Just for currency. Very easy. So let's put them in here. Let's also see what you guys are saying. OMG, Dreaded Jones. Thank you for everything. Ah, OMG, Rambo Main. Ah, $50. Ah. Rambo, Jeremy, you're killing me. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, hashtag don't nerf Rambo. I swallow. Oh no, I'm so sorry. I'm feel energized. Feel happy. I love you, my friend. Dreaded Jones, love you. Um, Dreaded Jones, thank you for everything. Honestly, thank you guys for everything. Because on if I was, if you guys weren't here, I would not be able to make these videos. These things would not be happening. Um, but yes, here we've got Rambo. Let's also take him into a very very easy um and rambo is just quickly quickly becoming one of the most hotly desired characters i feel you should be getting things for him so we can also use some consumables here not necessary but you can you can use heart of argus this will give you just slightly amount more souls but not necessary really not necessary um but yes if you are here at this part don't forget to leave a like helps out with getting this knowledge out there to more people and um i am really invested in helping people out with this game helping people learn um, it's fun. I really enjoy this game, and I hope more, more people can see the fun and easy easy things that I encounter in this game constantly. Okay, so let's take a look at the earnings here. We've got 15 souls, 13, 20 souls zero souls okay so i mean like this this is this is more than the 1235 we are using more um more consumables but it's not necessary you will get lots of souls from this and all that's required is for you to just press x right so the the advantage here is that no human error this is going for the amplified M60 every time, but it's really so much fun 
to just get this currency so easily. So as you see here, our souls are going up quickly. Really quickly. Oh boy. Okay, let's check out our soul balance here. Um, Mina says, hey everyone, I'm really busy right now, but just wanted to tell you, hello, oh boy, thank you, thank you, thank you, oh boy, um, uh, 90s vibe, corn, yes, corn, oh boy, so yes, oh boy, this is really just so much souls that we're getting, let's see now what we're at, okay, it's just, oh, we didn't go flawless, oh, very intriguing, ah, so, like I said, this build is about 96 to 98 percent effective at getting those flawlesses and brutalities ah he didn't go for the amplified ah um as well as you see there he's he's just he's just not going for the amplified move ah so scary ah i hope he goes for it but eventually the opponent is going to die here we go now we got it so sometimes the ai wants to go for other moves and at full distance this is when the AI becomes a little bit more finicky. At full distance, Rambo really likes to go crazy. Really loves to go crazy. Because he does have a lot of different projectiles. Um, oh boy. So let's see what you guys are saying. Uh, the comments disappear so quickly. Brezzy, are you colorblind? Yes, I am. It makes things beautiful when I can see things like this. Um, I love watching when the color husk. Oh, oh, when the corn husk. Oh boy. Brilliant as usual, Dave. That AI setup is just what I needed. Thank you. Yes, Roscoe. I'm so glad to help. It really brings me great joy to help you guys with all of these um, fancy builds. But yes, 96 to 98% effective at getting these flawlesses and these brutalities for you with just a little investment in rushdown. I think that's the key thing, the super key thing. So, okay, we're getting lots of souls. This is good. This is great. But how do we get our coin? So we can easily get the max quarter mil coin with the proper augments so let's let's back out of this tower we did five towers that's more than five thousand soul more than five thousand soul is good for meteor towers that'll get you two meteor towers so always keep in mind these currency things you should probably have a build like this set up just so that it can get you currency in your spare time. This is really necessary in order to get all of these things done. Now, let's swap this around to get ourselves max coin. To do that, all you have to do is switch one augment. So we're taking off perfect combat, and we are going to put on... Uh, uh, let's see if we can find it. Uh, here we go, dark magic. Okay, so what Dark Magic does, and Heart and Soul does, is that it takes all of the hearts that you earn, all of the hearts that you earn, and all of the souls that you earn, and converts them into a thousand coins apiece. This is capped at a max bonus of 250,000 coin. Um, so you don't necessarily need, like, the most augments to get max effect, you you don't even necessarily need these things at level 4. So if you just have like some of these things, this should be more than enough to get you the max um, coin cap. So we are going to take these augments here, same AI build, same abilities, just swapping around that one augment. And I think that's something very useful to know, how to quickly swap between hearts, souls and coins um, really all it takes is swapping around like one or two augments and then you're good so let's put on this thing here ai fighter yes um let's also put it on very easy um let's also for lols put on where is it where is it where's my where's the stolen oh it's on this page okay all right so we're gonna put on this thing i'm not too sure how it's going to act um, stolen riches was kind of glitched, kind of glitched with everything. Oh boy. Um, so I really like using this AI build for grinding all of the currencies. I don't think that grinding coin is super necessary anymore. Um, grinding hearts and souls, I feel, is really where it's at. But, um, having this thing, too, though, 
This is just getting you quarter million coin in the same amount of time. So let's take a look at the uh, the rewards here. Just, these things are so tiny. They could really make it better for like someone like me to see. Okay, so you're getting... <laughs> it's glitched. It's glitched. It's saying I'm getting 2.5 million. Can the game calm down? Can the game calm down? So this is the thing that I love about these um augments these augments really do glitch the game so if you check it out it says that i'm getting like 2.5 million coin um but I, in reality it's not really 2.5 million coin all it means is that i'm really like attacking that max coin cap with my rambo which is great which is very great i'm forgetting to press x this is really what i gotta do because all you gotta do is just press x go through the tower really quickly and with five matches you're an instant millionaire with five matches you can do five meteor towers and at least one lucky tower which only requires a million coin but as you see there quarter million and then 2.25 million for lols this is just hilarious so i really don't understand how they still have these glitches in the game don't be fooled you're not getting millions in a second but this is the fastest way of getting coin quarter million in a second requires no consumable requires no keys very nice all you need is just the ai setup and maybe some grinding to get those three augments that i keep on referring to defenseless uh ammo dump and rambo's character specific luckality augment yes you can't use shao khan's luckality augment on rambo it just does not work it just does not work. You have to get Rambo's um, luckality augment. And you do that by summoning lucky towers. And if you need some advice on how to get through these lucky towers, check out my video, Fastest Way to Farm Lucky Towers. That, that should be pretty helpful. But getting that luckality augment for Rambo just allows so much utility in the game that um, maybe... Like, I would have I would have recommended previously using Frost to get the augments, to get the currency, but you don't need to anymore. Especially sh since she got nerfed so hard with Bill of Health. Bill of Health being nerfed so hard really hurt a lot of characters. But, um, yeah, Rambo is able to just do this stuff handily, oh so handily, with the AI setup. This is really the, the spice here that you need. You need to have two rush down, 29 combos, 29 zoning, and I would say that you could experiment with 28, 28, 4, or some variation thereof. Keep in mind, keep in mind, the lower your combos, the less likely the AI will want to amplify the M60, and the less your zoning investment the less the ai will want to use the m60 altogether so you really need to have high amounts of these two things as well as just a little touch of rush down to counteract all of that rambo running away because him running away does not help out the situation you really need him to go for the move and get the kill quickly so that you can do the farming in a time efficient manner um and like i said these augments these can be quickly adapted to whatever you want just swap it around and then you'll be able to get yourself souls or hearts like right now we're set up for um coin right but we just take this off right and then we put on back perfect combat where is this Put on co uh, perfect combat, which is an elder ranked augment. And you can get this from the lucky tower at level 4, which is a very nice one to have at level 4. You get so many hearts from doing this. So yes, level 4 perfect combat, heart and soul, good soul, brutal heart. Now you're set up to get maximum amounts of souls. And as you saw, I was using the heart of Argus there to give me a little bit more, but not necessary. Really not necessary when you're getting more than a thousand in less than a... less than a minute. Less than a, it takes me like a minute to do like three, two or three matches 
depends on how quickly I press X. Depends on how quickly. Um, but yeah, then you could just take off heart and soul and put on whatever you want, and then now you're set up to get yourself max hearts. Use Tarkatan's Cannibal's Blade, and then you will get max hearts. So this build is very easily adaptable for any situation in, in the Survivor Towers to give you any currency that you want. Coins, hearts, souls. Okay, so let's see what you guys are saying in the chat. Thank you so much for joining along. Okay, so, um, oh boy, I swallow. Try not to be, um, is what is this what is this comment that you have left here i am like totally disagreeing this oh uh, how do we how do we um how do we do this yeah you, you get a timeout <laughs> calm down all right dan nunez hi jaded all right is it true that lucky rabbit's foot is even for obtaining better augments too no no dan nunez this is not true it does not help you get better augments it helps you get better scores and better um points and better ai difficulty when you're facing those lucky towers so its usefulness is pretty much only for lucky towers um but as you see here we don't need lucky rabbit's foot in order for luckality to work luckality works just fine on its own sorry just got here how should i get more souls well you gotta you gotta check out this whole video this you're reaching me here at the end angel rose i'm so sorry um but yes I really try to make these videos super helpful. Like, I hope that you guys enjoy them. It means so much that you take time out of your day to join me for this kind of stuff. Because I don't know if people are doing AI builds, if they're doing augment builds. I'm just doing things um, based on how I play this game. So this is what I'm using now to get me currency. Currency's good. Let us all roll around in hearts. Um, but yes, if you are here at this part, likes comments subscribes they are all greatly appreciated they help out with the channel so so much really they do um also i have a twitch a twitter also join the the jaded bunny fam special member only club with special perks including a daily sing song so um yes there is a daily sing song happening now thanks for letting us in on your tips much appreciated oh thank you creed i'm so glad okay so um yes i don't know if you're gonna be able to figure out this song i hope roscoe or like i don't know vasco or someone i hope you guys can figure it out maybe okay <clears throat> okay oh boy give me a second Jeremy, let's spar together, training together later. Cider Mike, I can't win it. Queen Melina always leaves likes. It looks as though my dear Vasco has got some skins. Well, tell me, I must know. Bunnies, when Jax's arms heat up, he's going for the mix up, but I'm just using ranks. Bunnies, I love the emojis, won't you come and join please, throwing razor rings. Marky Mark, co-op towers are so hard, but let's kill the leaderboard with Ragnar. Joel, catch him. Cartman is feasting while Africa is starving for Eric. As Roscoe loves Miss Minogue, with my hands in the air, I duck, walk, and vogue. 
um, bunnies come and join the streams it is like a dream throwing razor rings no 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 bunnies i love the emojis won't you come and join please throwing razor rings okay <laughs> <laughs> OMG, I was really channeling it there. I love that song. Do you guys know what that song is? Do you guys know what this song is? Hey Rambo, yes queen, don't speak. OMG, you guys know it! It's Don't Speak. It is Don't Speak. I love that song. It makes me, it brings, um, yes, warmth to my heart when I hear it. Um, but yes, I love you guys so much. I hope you enjoyed that. Please do consider joining the Jaded Bunny family to get written into a song. Yes, you might get your own chorus. <laughs> Um, but really, I love you guys so much. I hope you found this helpful. But if you ever have any questions, don't hesitate to leave a comment. I read everything. I respond to everything. I'm happy to help. Really, am happy. Um, but, uh, yes, I'm praying for you to get lots of currency. Go use this build. Let me know how it works for you. But until next time, please stay safe. Stay healthy. Stay happy, my friends. Take care. Peace. Love you guys.